Hey, we're going to introduce Steve and Marty right now, but I want to say here's some acting tips for you at home if you don't do the master class. This is the quick one. When you're talking and you want to act and you have to say a line like, uh, hey, uh, I think everyone's going to go tonight except for dad. You could do it that way, but it really helps if you have props. So you go like this. Hey, I think everyone's going tonight. <sighs> except dad. That's a good one. No, no, that was one, very acting. This one's good Solid. too. 10 when out of 10. When you're shocked, David? Yeah. Are you telling me my son's oh, right. gay? <laughs> Why are you mad about it? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> and then this one's good. I don't know. <laughs> who knew Fauci. that was such a mutating little mother? <laughs> That's my Fauci. Hey, Steve Probably Martin. can't use the gay one. but No, you can. It's funny. So Steve Martin, one of my all-time favorite of all time, uh, comics and then all the movies he did. We're just, ba you know, just bam, bam, bam from the jerk mm -hmm. to this. this. So yeah. many good ones. Always solid. Always humble. Likes to stay out of the limelight, uh, out of the main event. And mm -hmm. Martin Short, who's very <laughs> out there. Very, I think they're a great combo because of that yeah. on Only Murders in the Building. They also do a stand-up tour, which I've seen is a fucking home run. Um, they even do a joke about me in it. It's kind of flattering, right? Oh, really? They I have a joke like about you? Me, yeah. Oh, funny. And... Uh, yeah. And I was in the audience like, oh, what? And then everyone's like, ah, what a fucking burn, dude. And I'm like, oh, that's funny. You know, of course, I go along with it. Great guy, Cinder. Ha, 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 ha. Aren't I the asshole? <laughs> anyway, great. Uh, Dana, you add because I love I'm these I'm going to add to uh, Steve Martin, Martin Short, or as I think they should shorten the name, to Steve Martin Short because mm. every name is there. Boom. Um, mm -hmm. Steve Martin, you know, and Martin Short, I, I saw them both on television in the 70s. Martin Short thought, well, we look like we're in the same tribe. He does voices. He's cool. I was always in awe of him. And then, of course, Steve Martin was a huge influence on me because he wouldn't do jokes. It was all rhythm. Excuse me. So I would say it was slightly nerve-wracking to have both of your heroes on there, really. And now they are perfectly adjoined at the hip at this point of their career, and the act is incredible. They're such good friends. And so I would say it was a thrill to yeah. have both of them on. Very, very uh, Marty had an, a, one of the best years ever on Saturday Night Live. Has hosted a ton, and Steve Martin is just a force of nature in comedy in the last Do you forty years. Steve Martin's albums, I remembered oh, every yeah. goddamn line, and I couldn't help myself. I just wanted to say, this was funny. It's not even questions. This was good. He used to sing, and he'd go, "Grandpa bought a rubber." Okay, so, and that was his whole act, was just non sequitur. Let me try that around. with this thing. Okay, hold on. And he'd finish playing and go, this guy is good. Grandpa bottle rubber. Oh, it's a remake? <laughs> Grandpa bottle rubber. That was Steve Martin, with a little jazzy Homage. Thing. Yeah. Okay, guys, here they are. We don't waste your time anymore, these two uh, geniuses. We want to be longer than the actual podcast. I That's mean, our I goal in the close. intros is that it's literally they have the cadence. People calls. keep going. Okay. We have to. Mm -hmm. won't, They're still talking. Just, oh, not, we don't get to the real thing. Oh. Say the guys. Who's not even on this one? They, they keep forgetting. All right, here they are. Go, go, go.